What's happening? Oh my god, my voice just died. <coughs> yeah, today I'm going to talk about something that I truly do not understand. Like, it just... I just don't get it. I really don't get it. So today I'm going to talk about scammers and scamming uh, in general. Uh, this does not um, equal to this game. I mean, just in general. I mean, we all know that scammers exist and they certainly do exist in real life as well. But especially games like uh, Speed City, I think any game that has uh, an option to trade has, um, yeah, scammers, I guess. And I just don't get it. I don't get it. I've never been scammed in my entire life. I would just never give my stuff away. Just never. This is how to fix. This This could be This could be a tutorial for all of you noobs out there who really get scammed. Like, look, listen. I do get a lot of messages from you people. That was one, that was one of the reasons why I turned off um, the chat in Roblox. But um, I did enable it again. Sometimes I enable it, but I just sometimes can't listen to your begging. So I'm disabling it again so it's gonna be one of those kind of things so I'm gonna enable disable enable disable and um, you know I got a lot of people who message me and they say like oh Tyler listen I've got I got scammed could you please give me a trail of yours like 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 like, like stupidity is justifying anything like somebody's going like yeah can you give me your wife because my wife got taken by someone else so I want your wife and that's just like Dude, what the hell? Like, you're responsible for it. Why should I give you something when you're you're so stupid and you're getting scammed? I don't understand. I don't understand. I've never been scammed in my entire life. You know why? Because I just don't give away my stuff. This is, this is 101 on how to not get scammed. Just don't give your stuff away. I mean, it's as easy as that. I mean, anyone who gets scammed by giving other people their stuff for free is so stupid that they need to get scammed. This is my opinion on people getting scammed. And it is also, let me tell you something else, it's also a scam when most of the people tell me that they were scammed, so I give them items. Because they think I feel sorry for them, or they think because it boosts their chance of getting an item, I don't think so. This is not how it works, people. Um, it's So anyone out there right now using this technique, like saying, oh, look, I, I, I got scammed, can you please give me something? Or scamming themselves, or get scammed in real life. Um, you guys have a brain cell of a toast. I, I just gotta tell you, because it is really not rocket science not to get scammed. It's really not that difficult, people. It's not that hard. All you gotta do is don't open that chat window. Don't give out those trails. Just don't do it. That's all you gotta do. You gotta be an ego. You, you gotta have an eye ego. You gotta be an egoistical person. I don't know if that's a word, but that's what you gotta do. Just don't give your shit away. Just don't do it. And that's how you not get how to not get scared. Like I just I don't understand. I th it might be age. I gotta be honest with you. So when when I was thirteen or twelve, because the majority of the people who play this game are well, young, I guess, um, and uh, yeah, maybe they don't think this far, and this is why I'm making this video, so please share this video, and um, yeah, tell your friends, just don't give your stuff away, even if you think they are your friends, don't do it, like, I've already had a few stories where they were telling me, I oh, look, listen, my cousin <laughs> stole my trail from me, or like, <laughs> like what the hell? Um, yeah, it's just really confusing, and it's really annoying. So just don't get scammed. It's really not that hard. I swear to God, I've never gotten scammed in my entire life, because I just don't give my stuff away. Like, as soon as you open a trade, and as soon as you're giving someone something without a return, you can be, sh like, you have to always know that that item might be gone, even if it's a friend, even if it's a family member, even if it is your neighbor, it doesn't matter. If you give out something for free, the chances are, because we are all dumb, stupid little humans, that this thing might be gone forever. So I'm just saying, just saying, just saying. Um, yeah, if that happens to you, then you're kind of dumb. So I don't understand people getting scammed. Yeah, this is my 101 on how to not get scammed. Just don't trade with people. 
I mean, listen, yeah, there are like if you get into trading, for example, right? If you get into trading and you want to trade up, um, the risk of getting scammed and uh, you don't know the business well enough, then that's possible. I mean, if you, yeah, well, then I got scammed. That happened to me once. I played a bizarre day and I just started out playing that game. And somebody sent me a trade invite and I just thought that it was worth more than what I had. But at that time, what I didn't know was that I got super lucky with something and that my item was much more worth. But I thought like, huh, that's actually, it looks like he has a better item. And then I trade it. But that's not what I call scamming. That's just being stupid. <laughs> that's just um, not careful. That's just somebody going for blind trades. And yeah, so I really hope that you're not going to do that. So if you play any game, it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be Speed City. Because I think the up trading business is very difficult in Speed City. I highly uh think that it's very difficult to uh yeah trade up in speed city uh because just th these trails differ so hardcorely like there are a few rares there are a few rares that i would trade my ghost unstable to but other than that it's just like not worth not worth it so yeah um this is it ladies and gentlemen um yeah, uh, if you wanna, um, let me see. If you have a palm trail like that, if you have a pro palm trail and you wanna trade it to a ghost and stable, you can tell me. Uh, I'll trade that, which is kind of a bad trade for you. But some people wanna get into Ghost City because it really is worth it. It's the best map in the game, by the way. Check out my old video. And this is it, ladies and gentlemen. If you have any rare trails that are unobtainable, I would trade them to Ghost um, uh, Unstables, Ghost Trails, or whatever they're called. So yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Please stay safe. Don't get scammed because it just makes you look stupid. And I am certainly not going to support it. I'm not going to go like, oh my god, you got scammed. I feel so sorry for you. Here's my entire inventory. That's not going to work. That's not going to happen. So <laughs> uh, yeah, see you in the next video. Thank you for watching and goodbye.